Hey guys, welcome back to Mercedes Lounge. This right here is the 2021 Mercedes AMG CLA 35 Coupe. In this video, I'm going to show you guys all the exterior features of the CLA 35 Coupe. Take a look at the interior. Also, listen to the sound from the engine. This CLA 35 Coupe is finished in a polar white exterior color. On the interior, you have black MP text with Dynamica and red contrast stitching. From perspective, you have LED high performance headlamps, which have one eyebrow at the very top with another one underneath. This CLA 35 Coupe does not have the multi-beam LED lights, which would typically offer you adaptive high beam assist. Nonetheless, this LED high performance headlamps do look very, very exclusive. On the grille itself, you have a double bar atop the Mercedes Star, which houses your active distance distronic systems, which work very well with your radar tech on the windshield. Also finished in black, on the grille itself, lower bumper, you have very large air intakes on either side with the horizontal fins right here finishing in chrome. You have an even larger air intake underneath. Another cool feature of the CLA35, you have aerodynamic features right here, which offers you those gaps on the lower part of the bumper. And next to those two horizontal fins, you have a sensor right here for your driver assisted packages. You also have this high gloss black element right here, which accentuates design on the outer air intake. On the hood, you have those Mercedes AMG power domes, which sit right there, gives this car a very aggressive look. Side perspective, the size on the front tires is 235-40 R18. These are 18 inch rims, black accents, as well as the silver brake calipers. The front brakes are perforated to give you maximum cooling of these brakes. You have an emblem here, Turbo Formatic Plus, which means this car is all wheel drive all the time. This CLA35 does not have the AMG Night package, which typically offers you high gloss black elements on the window surrounds, as well as black side mirror housings. Instead, you have this chrome element right here on your window surrounds. You also have chrome door handles. Take a look at the rear tires. The size on these rear tires is 235-40R18. These are also 18 inch rims. The rear brakes are perforated and your gas cap, to open it, you wanna press and release and it opens in that fashion. Another cool feature, you have frameless doors. You can see the window pane is exposed. Now, taking a look at the rear design, you have these gorgeous LED taillights, which wrap around from this side of the car to the trunk itself. And tell me guys, what do you notice? This CLA35 has these chrome elements on the trunk itself, which means it does not have the AMG Night package. Nonetheless, it looks absolutely gorgeous on the rear. Rear diffuser, very simple. You have the single chrome tailpipes compared to the CLA45 Coupe, which has the quad exhaust system. And you have double chrome or with the AMG Night package, black chrome tailpipes. But this CLA35 does not have the AMG Night package, which means you have these chrome plated exhausts on the rear. And right here, you have the Mercedes bumperettes, which are a US regulation for your license plate. AMG badging on the left hand side, CLA35 badging on the right hand side. Also, you have this white rear spoiler. And I think it's a very, very cool design with the sloping roof line at the rear. Your Mercedes Star is also your trunk opener. Let's take a look at the trunk space and the cargo capacity. In here, you can fit at least two medium sized suitcases or one large suitcase and two smaller ones. The trunk space is deep enough. There is no electronic trunk close, which typically is somewhere around here. You have to hold this piece and pull the lever to close your trunk. So tell me guys, what do you think about the design of this CLA35 on the rear with all the additional chrome elements? You also have this design feature on the lower bumper with the black mesh right here, which gives this car a rather aggressive look. Let's take a look at the interior, starting with the rear seating. You can have two adults here in the back very comfortably. On the interior, you have black MB text with Dynamica and red contrast stitching. 
headrests very good quality comes with black seat belts you can actually get an option to change your seat belts these seats look like sports seats but these are your standard CLA seats in terms of leg room I'm 5'10 and I can fit in here quite comfortably the rear side for the passengers you have the dynamic material good armrests and you have some storage down here you have a speaker system right here also you have additional storage behind each seat and you have child safety hooks for your car seats as well on the back on the roof you have a panorama glass which sits on top of the car when it's open you have this mesh right here to trap any leaves or debris which might flow into the car when the panorama glass is open and i love the design of the panorama glass at the very top let's jump on the front and take a look driver side door you have this aluminium finishing right here you, you have an option to select a different trim option here like carbon fiber or wood trim the quality of these material is very high you have memory seating one two three and everything feels very solid on the door itself and then the seating arrangement in terms of comfort um, i have good support at the back i'm surprised it does not have heated seats that's a bummer if you want to get a CLA 35, you got to have heated seats if you live in cold areas. Window control options, good quality plastic and aluminium for opening your door. Handle, very good quality. Nothing feels cheap in here. You have two cup holders right here and some storage. You also have a trunk opener right here on the door. As I mentioned before, there is no electronic trunk close, so you have to hold this lever and close your trunk. You have a speaker system down here, an accessory light, does not have illuminated door sills, just aluminium down here. Let's take a look at the front perspective. You have these 10 and a quarter inch displays on either side, your digital instrument cluster right here, your center display. This car has the MBUX infotainment system or the Mercedes-Benz user experience system. Offers you very vibrant displays at the front. You have circular air vents on either side, which have this turbine design. They also have 64 color ambient lighting flowing throughout. On the other side, you have another circular air vent. Also notice on the upper dash, you have the aluminum AMG design right here. And it look very spectacular with those diagonal stripes at the front. On the upper dash, Ambitex wrapped, very good quality, feels very soft. Flat bottom steering wheel, courtesy of the AMG design, does not have the AMG drive unit, which offers you these spot knobs on either side of this quadrant of this steering wheel. You can get the finishing if you opt in carbon fiber or Alcantara material as well. You have touch controls on either side. The left touch control menus control your digital instrument cluster on the left hand side. The other control knobs control your center display. You also have Paddle shifters behind this AMG Performance steering wheel. You have your downshift and your upshift right here. And it's all very good quality material, finished in aluminium. And there's more than enough surface area at the back to hold on to your paddle shifters. Your climate control systems will be right here. These knobs, very good quality. They look like a set of piano keys. NFC charging right here. Two decent sized cup holders, which are deep enough. However, there is no lid right here to cover these cup holders your center console is finished in high gloss black or black piano liquid trim which is a fingerprint as well as scratch magnet this trackpad offers you haptic feedback that you get on your regular smartphone you have a home button right here you have media control options on the right hand side volume on and off navigation map radio telephone as well you have a traction control off button right here and your manual mode button right here at the center you have some storage it's also deep enough by the way you can store 
extra large uh, purse or anything you want to have inside here. On your center display, you have the MBUX system, which is fully touch screen right here. Let's go through some of the options real quick. You have your phone menu, radio, media, comfort. And in comfort, you have seat kinetics, which allows you to change the contour of your seats as you drive. You also have 64 color ambient lighting right here. You can change your, your colors inside your car with a multi-control system. You have AMG performance design. You can take a look at your engine metrics as you drive, engine performance, engine torque, engine oil temperature, transmission, fuel consumption, and take a look at your dynamic select options. Let's see what we have. You have Sport Plus, Sport, Comfort, Individual Mode, and Slippery. Those are your dynamic select options, which you can also use this dynamic select knob right here to control those as well. On the roof, you have accessories and other lighting options. So you have your reading lights and your interior cabin lights. You have your SOS button right here. And you have this button right here to open up your panorama glass at the very top. All very good quality material. Sun visors with the mirror and the light on either side. All very good quality material. And that's a brief look at the 2021 Mercedes AMG CLA 35 Coupe. If you like this video, please consider subscribing. Give this video a big thumbs up and see you on the next one. Until then, stay positive but test negative. Peace.